Yes, those are tater tots in the background, but don't mind those. This is the second installment. You guys made fun of me for the first installment because you couldn't hear me and the kids were screaming. So we sent the kids to the basement. Uh, we tried another <laughs> fast paleo recipe tonight. I'm showing it to you right now. It looks like a giant pile of deliciousness, but it actually was really good. Um, fastpaleo.com. Was the sh it's a sh recipe sharing site. They've got some other good stuff on there, but this one is onion, zucchini, and ground beef skillet, right? Um, super easy, super fast. Uh, tasted good. We added our, our own little seasonings and spices to it. Made it just enough, not quite paleo. I'll show you the. A1 sauce to make it delicious. <laughs> it tastes kind of like a, uh, what do you call it, a Philly cheesesteak. So depending on what your goals are, you can make it as paleo or as non-paleo as you want. Start it off with um, ground beef, not grass-fed, um, minced garlic. I put some shrooms in there too, in my portion. We did a red onion. We did three zucchinis. We sauteed it up in the skillet. Um, you saute the veggies first. Let me flip this around. Jen, here, you can take over. We sauteed the zucchini, the onion, the garlic, and some butter and olive oil. Let it get translucent. Then we took it out, put it on a, a baking sheet. Put it in the oven on like 400, 500 for like 10 minutes and let it get kind of crispy. In the meantime, made the ground beef brown. Um, I put some salt and pepper on that. Um, dumped the stuff back in after 10 minutes together with the ground beef that was cooked up. I didn't drain the grease because I'm a fatty. You could drain the grease if you wanted. Um, and then I put in some Worcestershire sauce. I put in a little bit of A1, um, and it was the bomb. It was the bomb. Uh, kids liked it. Kids even ate it. I also, I took part of it out and put some mozzarella cheese on there, even though that's not paleo, just to see, because I didn't know if it would be good enough, if the kids would actually eat it with their tater tots, but they did. Uh, but I put the mozzarella in there, that was fire. So if you're not really worried about paleo and you want to gain weight, throw the mozzarella in there and eat it with the tater tots. And then um, I went back and sauteed up some mushrooms and some more onion and then dumped it back in and kind of combined it all. So the end product with the mushrooms, onions, zucchini, mozzarella cheese, A1 sauce, not quite paleo. You can make it as paleo as you want, but it was, what did it take, 15 minutes? Yeah. It was the bomb. Kids are going to bed. I'm fat and happy. Okay. That's round two. See you guys.